Now let me show you how to set up your AdWords account. Now um, go to adwords.google.com. Okay, so once you're here, click on Start Now. Okay, so click on Standard Edition. Right, because uh, once you have gone through my video tutorials, you will have more than enough knowledge to skip the starter edition. So now click on standard edition and click on continue. So first, uh, we will set our customers by English, okay, English language. So we can, and then we also set our countries and territories, okay. Uh, select the countries and territories okay you can also do regions and cities if you are targeting the local communities now if you click customize you, know, you can actually uh, make your ad appear like let's say you want to fix X8 mouse for your business so your, your ad will actually appear if someone were to search for your business 8 mouse away from you uh, but for this example we will do countries and territories alright so the next thing you need to do is just click on continue Okay, so by default, your country will appear in the Select Countries panel over here. Uh, but, I, but I always like to use all countries for research purpose or when I'm starting out. Now, I know that there are a lot of people who will say that my traffic will not be very targeted and there will be a lot of junk traffic. But when I'm starting a new campaign, I prefer as, to drive as much traffic as possible to my site so that I can gather all my statistics and fine tune from there. So uh, let me first <coughs> remove this Singapore and then I'll add in all countries and territories. Okay, so once you're done, click on continue. Now the next step is to create your ads. Now don't worry about your ads at the moment as I'll be explaining more in depth details on how to create a profitable ad in the next few hours and uh, in the next few videos. So for this video, it will be a run through of how to set up your AdWords campaign. So let's key in your AdWords ad right now. <coughs> now the next step is to create your ad. Now don't worry about your ad at the moment as I will be explaining more in depth details on how to create a profitable ad in the next few videos. So for this particular video, it will be a run through of how to set up your AdWords campaign. So now let's key in your AdWords ad. Alright, so uh, for headline, let's key in new video game secrets. That's S -E -C -E. Right. So for description one, let's key in complete your video game in three days. Right. So for line two, let's key in guarantee new and unheard of. Right, so most of the time you'll find that your click through rate will increase if you use if you start with capital letter for all your words. As you can see here, I'll I always start my words with capital letter. Uh, your click through rate will increase, will improve. Right, so and also use your uh, primary keywords in your ads as much as possible. So when your prospects search for the keywords that you have bid on your ads will be in bold. Your keywords will be in bold, sorry. And it will stand out much more than your competitors and this will definitely increase your click through rate. Now let's key in our display URL. Alright, so uh, usually, when you key in your display URL, right, your destination URL will follow the same. Okay. Now let me explain what's the difference between these two URLs. Right. So for display URL, right. So 
uh, is the URL that you want to display in your Google AdWords. Yeah, the display, the URL that you want to display in your ads. So for the destination URL, is the URL that you want to send your prospects to when they click on your ads. So if you have a tracking code, you can also put your tracking code in your destination URL. Uh, but for this example, we do not have a tracking code, so let's use the same URL as the display URL. Right, so once you're done, click on continue. Uh, in this page, this is where we will input our keywords. Now let's key in the two keywords that I have chosen, that I have prepared. Okay, first is uh, video game secrets and also quotation video game secrets and also black cat video game secrets alright so let me key in the other keywords that I've prepared video online game secrets Quotation online video game secrets and bracket online video game secrets and also the negative keyword. All right, so um, now it's let's also um, it, it's okay if you don't know what this uh, phrase match, exact match, and the negative match option means. Okay, because uh, over the next few video, I will be explaining more in depth about how you can use your matching option uh, in your keywords. So once you're done, click on continue. Okay, now this is the part where they ask you about your daily budget. Now, but before you set your daily budget, make sure that your currency is in US dollar. Alright. Okay, now the next thing is to enter your daily budget. Now, you may want to calculate how much you are willing to spend per month and then break it down into your daily budget. You know, for this example, let's key in $20. Right, so along the way, if you feel that you are spending too much money or are not spending enough, you can always edit your budget later on. Now after you enter your daily budget, uh, it's time to enter your default uh, bid for your keywords. Now I usually like to start off with 20 cents. Now once you're done, you can click on View Traffic Estimator. Right, so uh, this is a view traffic estimator to gauge how much traffic you will receive. Now, but whatever you see here is just a gauge and it's not 100% accurate. But it will give you a good idea where you are heading. Right, so once you're done, uh, click on continue. Now, you will reach the review section. Okay, so over here, make sure that everything is in order according to how you, ha you have set it up. All right? Make sure the campaign, the English, your currency, your budget, your advertisement, all right? your keywords. Okay, oh, I can take away this as, don't, as, as, as I don't like to receive emails. Okay, you can also click here. How do you hear first hear about Google AdWords? Okay, maybe former tips uh, from a friend. All right, so uh, you may want to check it through. So once everything is in order, click on continue. So what's happening next is that Google will ask you which account do you want to link your AdWords to. Uh, so uh, if you have a Google services, you can click here and it will ask you whether um, do you like to use your existing Google account for your AdWords. If you do, just key in your Google account, email, and password. Okay, so if you not if you do not use any of the services, you can create a new Google account for your AdWords. 
So once you have created your account by filling in the information here, Google will send you an email to verify your email address. So all you need to do is just click on the link in your email and you'll be able to log in to your new AdWords account. So once you have logged into your AdWords account and provide Google with your building details, now your ads will be turned on and Google will start displaying your advertisement.